Hi, I'm Dr. Tim Joshin, and today we have Christina, who's our patient who's getting a little bit of filler. And so I always like to find out what's on a patient's mind. And so Christina, tell me, yesterday we talked a little bit. What yeah. area did you notice? Okay, so now that I'm aging, my I need a, you know, a little filler on my nasal labia fold, and I have a little hollowness here on my temples, okay. and a little bit on my jawline. Okay, great. So I think that these are great areas to treat. Um, she just has a little bit of hollowness. And one thing, I mean, I'm not going to ask Christina how old she is, but, mm. you know, she could tell me she's 20 and I would believe it because she looks great. I mean, Christina <laughs> looks really good. But I know she's probably not because she has five kids. So, <laughs> but she, she, she really has, she's really been blessed. So I think um, a broad forehead is a sign of youth. And so I think we'll put a little bit of filler in here to sort of give it that little bit of width. I definitely think in here, you can't see it with the bright lights on. I like the bright lights because it erases wrinkles mm -hmm. on me. So the light is for me, <laughs> not for her. Makes us look good. <laughs> <laughs> but she does have a little bit of a fold here, which we can improve. And then one of her concerns is her jawline. Now, really when we look at Christina, she's blessed because she has a very full, youthful face. And one of the signs of aging is that we lose the baby fat in her face and so she's not losing it as much. So it looks great and it's not saggy, which also is, is a great thing. But I do think that if we could soften this a little bit, it would be great. That's a totally different video. That would be profound, kybella, um, and maybe a buckle fat pad removal. Those are the kind of things that we would think about. So we're gonna put a little bit here and then I think I'm gonna put a little bit in your chin too. Okay, okay so we're gonna get started. We're using a really great product today. It's called Velour by uh, uh, Allergan. It's a great product, and the reason I like it so much is because it's smooth and it lasts for 18 months. So this is kind of a versatile filler, um, so I love it. And so we're going to get started. We just want to give her a little bit of breadth here near the forehead. So this is the temple region, and I'm just really trying to make it look like a continuous smooth transition into her temple from her forehead. Now, Christina was a little nervous. She couldn't tell, mm -hmm. but I get a little nervous when I get this done, too. How bad is the pain, Christina? Not too bad. Good. Good, good. And today's our Jersey day at the office. And who are you representing, Christina? Green Bay. Green Bay. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Who's your team, Victoria? <laughs> yeah, who are you liking, Christina? Okay. Our, our, is our audience all gonna watch the Super Bowl? I'm actually going to go skiing because it's a great day with no crowds. So I took advantage of it. And besides, it seems a little bit hypocritical to watch one game a year. <laughs> I'm holding true and not watching any. Okay. So see how nice this is looking. It's really great. It just smooths out that forehead. I like a little bit of con, uh, concavity in the temples. When I say concavity, I mean just a slight depression. Not a kind of cavity. And so one thing that's great is you can come in this month and we have what we call our liquid facelift special. It's a great opportunity to get um, lots of fillers at a discounted rate. So we, you get buy four, get two free. And a lot of people are like, oh, six is going to be way too much. I don't want to look fake. Um, well, on Christina, we're going to be doing four today. And you'll see that four doesn't really go that far. And I think... I have, I have girls that'll put three, and I, I should say young women, excuse me, um, that'll put three syringes just in their lips. Now, I agree with those of you who are thinking that's a lot of filler, but um, anyway, five syringes is only a tablespoon or a teaspoon of uh, filler. So it really doesn't go very far, but with that amount, you, you'll actually definitely see a result. If you do onesies, twosies, you're not necessarily gonna see much of a result. Okay, great. So now we did our nasal labial folds. And now I'm going to do a little bit of jaw along the jawline. Again, with her, I don't think she's the best candidate for um, the treatment along along her jawline, but we're going to do a little bit because it's what she wanted. Um, you know, people who do better with this are um, don't have the fullness here. And so you'll see much more of a pop. I like this treatment for older people where the bone starts to demineralize and disappear. And it's an area where a lot of people don't realize because we look at ourselves just in one dimension, not in two dimensions. Okay, so now I'm going to put a little bit on her chin because, uh, you know, this is a new area that people are really focusing their attention on. And I'm just going to give her, try to give her a little forward projection with a filler. 
And again, 18 months, it's a nice filler because it, it lasts for 18 months. The original fillers only lasted for six months. And we can see how nice this is just giving a little bit of that forward projection. Look at that. Okay, so that's it. We did four syringes today and we softened Christina's nasal labial fold. We gave her a little bit of breadth here, giving her a much more youthful uh, forehead. Gave her a little bit of forward projection here and just gave her a little bit of enhanced jawline. So if you have any questions about fillers, feel free to contact us. And also don't, don't miss out on this special. We, we don't do this very often and it's a great uh, way for you to get um, near full correction. So thank you for tuning in and please click like on this video and also follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube.